man, Ben. What's up? I'm just trying to figure out how to prioritize my accounts right now. So many different target accounts, and I don't even know where to go. Well, I got the video for you. You do? Check out <laughs> this clip on how to segment your accounts, prioritize your outreach, and personalize your messaging to get a meeting with anyone. Really? I can't wait to check it out. Yeah. So, you're a salesperson, you're a marketer, you're working with sales. We've now segmented our account list. That's great. Now, what do we do with these segmentations? We have all these accounts. We have tier one, tier two, tier three, tier four accounts. What do we do with it? This is where we'll use the tiers to actually prioritize our outreach. So as I mentioned earlier, our tier four accounts, as a salesperson, we're really not focusing too much on them. This is where we're kind of work with marketing and kind of have some marketing support on these guys, get them more sales ready. Um, personally, I don't like to use any automation, uh, like automated cadences and outreach or sales loft. If your organization does use that, if you guys feel comfortable with that, your tier four accounts would be a pretty good uh, option to put in an automated cadence. We want to spend as little as much time as possible on our tier four accounts, right? As these qualified accounts show intent, this is where we start to pay attention to these accounts because now there is some sort of propensity to buy that we want to make sure we're looking at. At this point, I'm working closely with my SDR. We're now putting them in a one-to-many cadence. That cadence is going to consist of email and phone. And now, as they're either, uh, you know, maybe we chat in the past or they're showing engagement, this is our tier two accounts. This is now where the AE, myself, would start to get involved in the tier two and tier one accounts. For me, we're putting them in a one-to-few cadence, meaning there are areas where it's templatized. However, there are a lot of areas for personalization. We're also starting to expand upon the channels that we use. So we increase our personalization. We expand upon the channels that we're using. So for these, we may use email, phone, and even LinkedIn in our cadences. Right? You guys can see a kind of pattern here. At this point, our tier one accounts, I mentioned these are our, our accounts we're doing white glove service to. We're going to use one-to-one -one personalization, more time spent on accounts, the higher we go up in the tiers. More channels are going to leverage, more personalization, more research, right? Because again, your time is valuable as salespeople. And that's the data sets we look for to segment our accounts and prospect more effectively. I was really taking notes. That's some good tips. Yeah, check out next episode where we dive a little bit deeper into uh, some sales tactics. Thank <laughs> you.